I love when you drive in, you, it's kind of like you don't expect such an amazing place to be where it is. You're sort of driving through back streets and then, hang on a minute, this is huge and amazing and really quite spectacular, the, the external part of it all. Set on 50 acres of absolute beachfront in Byron Bay, it has 193 private villas that are perfectly blended in with the natural surroundings. Come check in. Yeah, cool. Um, but you can leave your luggage in the car because yeah. you have a spot. After six years of planning, design and development, plus $100 million, Elements of Byron opened at the beginning of 2016, bringing five-star barefoot luxury to Byron Bay. It has all the wellness options, but it also still has caffeine and sugar and alcohol. I haven't found that we were sort of wanting for anything. We arrived, there was this delicious iced tea on arrival. We sat down, had lunch, then had a swim, waiting for our room to be ready. What do you think? It's so big, so you can literally feel like you've got the place to yourself. Food was good. Lunch was nice. I love it. It's so quiet. It's my vote. <laughs> It feels high-end and quite glamorous, but at the same time really down to earth. I think it's the fact that it's on the sprawling property with the accommodation dotted through natural surroundings. Yeah. When you step inside, it's just bright and breezy. It smells divine. They have these beautiful Byron Bay diffusers. It's split level, spacious, gorgeous freestanding bath. We do drive up to here. Yeah. And that would mean if we're facing this. It means the pool's just here. I would say over that way. <laughs> that one. Yep, with 50 acres to navigate, you're definitely going to need the map. Love the fact that there's an adult pool, because I imagine in the, in the warmer months it's really packed here. So if you don't bring the kids, there's a place you can escape to. And it's a cocktail bar, it's a swim up bar. And I love it's got these cool swinging seats that you can sit beside the bar on the swings. Love a bit of novelty. And it had a little kiosk that was cooking, I think it was Greek food, but super cute. And you've got these little huts that you can sit around and just lay there, get the waiter to bring everything to you. So we had some beautiful mocktails. They were good. They were very good. And as day turns to night, it really comes to life. The lighting they've used is so spectacular. And you've got to take a stroll down to the beach because there is no one there and you get to see this magnificent sunset. How spectacular is this fire pit? And then when you head into the restaurant, it's all class. I mean, there's a more casual side, but we went into the fancy side And as you can see, the food was delicious. Sorry, I didn't get a before shot. Ah, oh, then a nice sleep. And hello, Byron Bay in the morning. How beautiful is this? Pretty specky. I'm waking up in Byron. Yeah, I was probably used to be a bit skeptical about resort places to stay, but this is really nice. And also, you know, you're in Byron, so you're surrounded by a fantastic place. This is out of slightly out of town, so you're not right amongst it. You know, town's just there, lighthouse is there. But it's really quiet. I mean, this, there's no one on this beach. This far north, it's beautiful. And if you 
there for the wellness. They offer yoga in the morning overlooking this view. Could it get any better? Seriously. The day spa looks incredible. It's beautifully designed. Amazing chandelier. Haven't had time to experience it this time, but it's, it's well worth a visit. I have been there before. When we logged into the Wi-Fi, it asked us if we could think of anything different that we'd like to improve. And last night I couldn't think of anything. So that's what I wrote, I can't think of anything. Now we were only there for a 24 hour stop this time, unfortunately, but I do recommend 10 minutes down the road is the farm. If you haven't already been there, head there because it's just got this beautiful feel. I love going there for breakfast and it's well worth a visit. And that's about as free range as you're gonna get. It's principally a working farm, but it houses a collection of micro businesses with a shared common goal. They love inviting people to come and see how a farm actually operates, supports the environment and contributes to a healthier lifestyle. Their motto is grow, feed, educate and it inspires everything that they do. For more information visit elementsofbyron.com.au and thefarm.com.au For more wellness and travel content don't forget to subscribe to Destination Happiness YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.